Hello, I'm Jerry Romine, the Entrepreneur Abroad. New investors are fascinated with penny stocks because they offer tremendous potential at such a low cost. And in today's short video, we're going to cover the top 10 penny stocks based on sales volume. Today's video format is going to be a little different because none of these top penny stocks have good fundamentals. So we're not going to spend too much time in the beast mode stock analysis. But if you're a new investor thinking about penny stocks, then stay tuned because I'm going to go over some penny stock basics and I'm going to be brutally honest. For my fundamental investors, don't worry because in a future penny stock video, I'll be covering some top penny penny stocks that have really good fundamentals and earnings that also have long-term investing potential. Of course, I'm not a financial advisor and this video is for entertainment purposes only. So grab a cup of coffee and hang on because this is not your normal stock channel. What are penny stocks? According to the Securities and Exchange Commission, the penny stock definition is any share of a public company trading below $5 per share. Why is volume so important? High volume happens when a catalyst of some sort drives a flurry of new buyers into the stock. A new contract, a press release, or a rumored buyout can act as a catalyst. Number two, you want to follow the money. Number three, high volume creates swings. Number four, swings create opportunities. And number five, volume is the lifeblood for trading penny stocks. Let's go over some quick penny stock basics. Number one, if you're new to penny stocks, I really recommend you paper trade first. Number two, avoid over-the-counter penny stocks because they do not have full financials available for a review unless you're trading solely on the technicals. Number three, high volume only. You want a minimum daily volume of 100,000 shares. Number four, a minimum $1 price. And number five, trade small. Never more than 10% of the penny stocks daily volume. Why are these 10 penny stocks recovering today the best penny stocks to buy and sell. It's really simple. Volume, volume, volume. Whenever you have crazy volume, you have opportunities. Forget the fundamentals. For penny stocks, it's all about the technicals. Welcome to Beast Mode Stock Analysis. Today we are looking at penny stocks and this is going to be a very abbreviated version of the Beast Mode because these penny stocks do not have good fundamentals and they're really day trades or short term swing trades. So this will be pretty quick but let's go over the stock ticker symbols. We have IGC, BOXL, HTBX, SNDL, ZOM, PEIX, TRVN, IDEX, TTOO, and OAS. A few things we can look at. We can see what the return is over one week, one month, and three months. And that's just good for a quick glance. We can see what the PE ratio is, and everything here is negative. For revenue growth, the only thing that stands out here is one company, SNDL, which is Sundial Growers. They have positive revenue growth over the last 12 months. Levered free cash flow is really bad, which is to be expected, except for two companies, PEIX and OAS. There's no dividends. The financials look bad. For operating margin, we can see that everybody here is looking bad. The next thing that stands out is the total assets versus total liabilities. And a few of them do have some assets with our strongest one being IGC. The net income margin looks pretty bad. And then scrolling on down, what else do we have? We've got some estimated intrinsic value. Not really very useful on this short term of a trade. We have the analyst target mean prices, number of buy recommendations. And the last thing that stands out today would be the book value ratio for SNDL. It shows 1.67. So the current book value per share is $1.17 and the current stock price is $0.70. Cents. And that's it for the beast mode on these guys today. Let's go over my stock picks for today, starting with the beginner picks, and I'm just going to be brutally honest. For beginners, steer clear of these penny stocks. When you play with fire, you get burned, and there are a lot of professional sharks out there, and they eat newbie investors like guppies. The best thing you can do if you're new and you're interested in penny stocks is start by paper trading for practice, and once you feel good about that, then consider jumping into the deep waters and going live. For the long-term investors, there are no great long-term picks today, but you can swing trade the following stocks. TTOO has a normal looking chart and it actually looks pretty good. So if you wanted to try swing trading, that would be worth a shot. PEIX is currently in a breakout and TRVN also has a pretty good looking chart. The above stocks all have charts with regular swings. So if you want to practice swing trading, consider these stocks. And for the penny stock specialists out there, you guys already know what to do. And you guys know that penny stocks are great for either going long or short. And these are the highest volume penny stocks in the last week. So this is where you should be starting your search. There's plenty of plays to be made for the penny stock specialist. Just be sure to check the charts. And as a general rule, avoid stocks trading under $1. One stock to check out is IGC. They just received FDA approval initiation for their cannabinoid trial on Alzheimer's patients, which will likely give a few days of day trading opportunity 
companies if the volume holds. And to everyone, IGC is a really good example of a catalyst moving a stock price from no volume to crazy volume. You might want to check it out on the charts, and this is really typical in penny stocks. If you enjoyed today's content, be sure to like this video and check out my free tools at jerryromine.com. Thanks for hanging out with me today, and we'll see you soon on a fresh new video. If you have not already, make sure you sign up for Webull to get a free stock worth up to $1,400. Webull is much more than a free stock trading app. And I have a free tutorial video on Webull that's so good, Webull actually called me after viewing it. Both the promo and Webull tutorial link are in the description below.